morning, it's Anne. Um, I don't know why I always start with that because of course you know it's me. Um, just a quick update, I wasn't on, on here yesterday really, um, at all, uh, except to um, post the video to which it had no sound the day before. Anyway, my mouse isn't working properly this morning, I was at the dentist yesterday. Um, didn't keep me to my appointment, which I absolutely hate. That was a mess up. Not with the receptionist this time. It was a mess, a mess up with the uh, medical staff, so I wasn't happy. Um, anyway, it transpires that um, they're not now going to take seven teeth out. They're going to take five teeth out. Got to go back next Tuesday to see the restoration man. <laughs> restoration, wasn't that a film? Um, the damage to my jaws has been, I was going to say phenomenal, 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 I can't even say phenomenal, but um, not as bad as they thought because they thought I might have to have constructive surgery on the jaw and um, there'd be a lot of problems further down the line. There are going to probably be problems further down the line because um, the damage is now done, but um, to the bisphosphonates. But I'm healing quite well, so that was a major concern that's not of much concern now, um, given that the other teeth have healed, gums have healed from the other teeth being extracted, the gums have healed quite well. So um, back next Tuesday, see the restoration man, see the surgeon, both of them together, and then decide what's going to happen and when. It's going to be three months before um, all this current work, at least three months before it's all completed. So I would say we're going up till after Christmas now. Um, I'll just be patient and wait. Um, as long as they're not dragging their heels too much and don't keep making mistakes with my appointments. Anyway, that's that. I didn't get to see Alfie <clears throat> because I was back here quite late. Um, so I shall be on my way very, very shortly and stay a bit longer today um, with him. But I did ring and he's, he, was, he was well yesterday. It's strange, isn't it, when it's the one nurse on that there's always a problem and when it's always um, one or two particular carers on um, that there's a problem. They just don't know. Um, I'm saying they don't know how to, how to handle it. Um, but I'd go further and say they don't, they choose not to know. And the easiest way is to zap him with a chemical kosh. But um, the complaint's gone in now about the nurse and the carer concerned. So hopefully he's going to be in a good mood this morning. I won't video him today um, unless he's in exceptionally a good mood. Um, and I shall come back here and get some sleep. I did sleep last night just for a change. And believe it or not, I probably got about seven or eight hours sleep straight through. And I can't remember the last time that happened. So I'm feeling not too bad this morning. Um, so yeah, some of the plans are today, go and see Alfie, um, hopefully he's in a good mood, if not hopefully he'll be in a better mood by the time I've left. I say moods, they aren't moods, they're um, episodes brought on by um, the dementia mainly, not helped when people don't know how to um, soothe him. Uh, but as I say, I'll, I'll hopefully leave him um, in a good frame of mind. Um, you know, sometimes we just choose to lie on the bed together and have a sleep. That hasn't happened for a while. So maybe that'll happen today. So um, I'll be there for a few hours anyway. Um, come back. Uh, oh, I have what to do. I reply to all my emails. I've caught up with everything. So, 
I'll allow myself a couple of hours this afternoon just to late afternoon probably just to have a read maybe just have a, a lie in the bath and, and have a facial because I surely need one um, and just generally relax so I'm looking forward to that early evening, late afternoon, early evening um, at the moment I'm just getting ready as I say to go out and see out and uh, I'll pop back in on here later, but as I say, unless he's exceptionally bright, I won't post a video today. I just want to spend some quiet time with him today um, and be thankful for the fact that, as I say, it's the Parkinson's and, and the dementia that's slow moving. Um, and, and, you know, I'm grateful for that. Um, but I also think it's got a lot to do with Alp, that he's very, very strong. He's never given in, he's always been very resilient. Um, and I think a lot's got to do with that inner resilience. Um, and the not giving up. And now when it really has taken hold, um, he's still coping inside there. Alp is still there. He still comes out with the I love you and I can see Alfie there. He'll still come out with funny comments or when I'm going, you're not going yet, are you? So I'll stay a bit longer. Uh, he's still there. He's still there, my beautiful man. Anyway, I'll uh, I'll be back on here later. I just wanted to let you know why I've all been um, missing in action yesterday missing any inaction as the case may be i hope you hope everybody's well recovering from that terrible terrible hurricane and weather um and peace have a wonderful day be back this evening bye bye